What's up guys, Ankle Spangin here, and today we are playing as full AP, full CDR, Sona in the mid lane. And, I know that was a long ass introduction, but I was including the full CDR there because I feel like it's very relevant. CDR on Sona is different than other champions because of her crescendo, alright? Basically, on top of your 45% CDR that you can get normally, Sona's ultimate now has the bonus passive of it that they put on there uh, that reduces the base cooldown of all of Sona's basic abilities, which are Q, W, and E, by 20%. I don't remember if that ranks up further. I didn't get to the point last game where I could find that out, and I didn't look it up because I'm a gigantic lazy idiot. But, the point is, that stacks multiplicatively with normal CDR. That doesn't just, like, say 20% and that's that. That actually stacks up. So you can get your Q and your W and your E abilities all down to, like, 67% CDR. It's basically like playing Earth, which, to me, is just, just ridiculous. Just absolutely ridiculous. So, you know what? I just missed two CDR for poking, or two CDR, two minions for poking there. Not exactly the best trade, but it's still all right. It's all good. We're still getting a lot of damage off on this guy. Let's go ahead and eat the tornado here, just so I can get a bunch of damage off on this guy. It looks like he wants to try and fight me, but he's just going to lose miserably. So the Ignite coming out, a horrible all-in from Yasuo there will be going down. Your boy getting first blood, and that will be good for us. So let's... I don't know, let's... Damn, I... I didn't... <laughs> I didn't expect to get first blood already. So I, I wasn't ready for this. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, move on out of here. Looks like we got, what's his dick face right there, penis breath or something, whatever, Nocturne, that's the champion. We got Nocturne trying to uh, mess with us a little bit, but I gotta get just a tiny bit more money before I can go back, and I should have enough now, because I want to get a tier on my first back. I was thinking last game about builds, right? And I thought about it. What am I talking about? Who needs a fucking tier, dude? Who needs a tier? Get out of here with that tier of the goddess bullshit. We're going for that Namakon first. So Namakon will be our first bet here. I'm going to go ahead, start running out of the base, grab some booties as well, because obviously boots on Sona when she's flying make a lot of sense. But it's not my job to make sense. It's my job to make murder, make slain, make death. So let's see if we can live up to that name. We are already, uh, you know, about half of Yasuo's CS, basically because I'm a god. So let's go ahead and just see if we can get in this shit right here. There goes his flash. He will be doing some good damage there. So maybe, nah, we're not going to go for more. Or will we? Or will we? Nah, we're not. But there goes his flash for sure. Maybe if I got a proper, um... Q or a uh, proper whatever it is off on him. I'm coming. This guy is not going to be feeling too spicy. There's the staccato flash for the auto attack. We will be getting him. Let's go ahead and see. Can we get another one? There's the Q. There's the auto. Come on. No, son of a bitch. God damn it. My last auto attack wasn't enough. God, I got to twist my nipples a little bit. Okay, that sucks. Man, I thought that last auto attack would be enough. Maybe, I mean, you know, not maybe. I definitely shouldn't have gone for that. Uh, it was a little, as they say, aggressive. Um, but, you know, I just wanted it, man. I just wanted it too bad. So hopefully he doesn't go for a dive here. That would be a suicide, a death wish. So, doing some good damage there. Gonna get that, uh, oh, he could, do, he could go for that now that his wind wall's down. But it looks like he's choosing not to. Respectable. Respectable. But now we, uh, <laughs> I lost a lot of shit for that. I was really hoping I could get that kill off onto Nocturne when I flashed for him. Unfortunately, my flash was for nothing. Because Graves actually did have the kill. I didn't know Graves had his dash. So, whoopsies. It seems we picked a whole bouquet of whoopsie daisies with that choice. But, it's all good. We're all good. We're still going to be fine in this lane. It's going to be a little rough for just a little bit longer now. Um, but I think we'll be all right. I think we'll be just dandy dandy. It looks like, uh-oh. Oh, well, maybe, maybe. All right, I'm running. No, I'm not. Take it back. <laughs> I take it back. I'm going right back to my lane. I'm not going to get there near in time to do diddly squat. 
So if I just leave it as uh, an uninvolved situation, it should be... Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. So let's see. Oh, he's going for a ship first. So that's... That's that. Oh, it didn't go past this time. Go ahead and get that damage off right there. I was like, does he want to do this? Oh, get dodged, sucker. Look at that damage. Look at that return damage. Come here, get staccatoed. Damn, dude. There goes, like, all of his health just like that. And by all of it, I mean about half of it because all of it would be a little excessive. But, hey, what the hell? Beat's already on a killing spree? Young Beat, a.k.a. Young Beast, showing us why we call him that. We'll be 3 and 0 down there already. So lots of damage going off on this guy already. Do some more damage to him right there, even though I totally missed. Let's go ahead and get our potions ticking. And we'll queue up on this guy. Drop the ignite. Drop the auto attack. He's gonna go down, right? Right? Oh my god, that Yasuo shield. Dude, come on. He lived with 7 health. How upset can I be? <laughs> Unlucky, though, dude. Unlucky. Better to just lose the kill than go for anything too crazy. But we will be shoving him out of lane there again. We do need to be careful of that guy, but we do have Graves right here. So this could be good. Let's go ahead and see if we can wait for that to fall off. Boom! Pick up that kill right there with the ultimate. Waiting for his spell shield to go off. Will be a free kill right there, just like that. And now we can go back. Zach is coming in, so I'm going to skedaddly bop Don Doodle on out of here. Uh-oh, the Flim Flubber going to Grim Gloozler all over his Flim Dangler. It looks like let's bounce all over his... Oh, God, he's shotgunning everywhere. Maybe, maybe. Is he going to be able to get out? Getting Flubber fisted. Mordecai's is on his way. Using the smite after the auto attack. That's a bold move. But will it be enough? It will. He will not be going down there. Nice. So that's... That's pretty rad for us. Pretty rad. And let's go ahead and grab this Sheen. This should help us a lot with our damage. I don't know exactly how much it'll help us with our damage early. But we will be going for the Sheen into the Lich Bane into the Blumenomicon. And then we'll probably go for a Zonia's this game. Because while Abyssal Scepter is very good, um, I'm thinking I'm going to go for the Zonia's. You take. I can't afford to go get it right now because there's too many minions um, sitting right in my tower. It would be very very bad for me actually to go get that right now so i'm gonna use my heal just with the sheen effect so i can get that minion just in case anyone was wondering why i healed there wait is he he's actually sitting there tanking it oh my god he's gonna fucking die he's gonna fucking die oh my god i cannot believe <laughs> okay guys if <laughs> If you're jungling, now that that guy right there is a true fucking hero, but I do not recommend doing that. <laughs> what a god, though. What a god. Regardless, though, I do not recommend doing that um, because that does really take a lot of time out of your jungling. Um, and it also, obviously, r makes you run the risk of dying. So, again, thank you for the blue. Greatly appreciated, but that was, well, that was definitely something, something. So let's see, Brett, what, that didn't kill him? Or not kill him, but obviously it didn't kill him. Let's see, oh, come on, do it. Do it, fucking, wait, you didn't ult me? <laughs> what? Why didn't he ult me? All right, hang on, we gotta do this, let's do this. All right, there goes that, let's go for this, and there's the spell shield, kaboom, there's the kill. We just had to wait for it, picking his ass up, see you later. Get out of there, Nocturne, get out of there, you little gravy baby. Actually, all babies are made of baby gravy, technically. But that's a topic for another time. So we will get that kill off on him there. And that will be super free, and even Yasuo did use his Ignite. So on top of all of that, we got even more than we may have bargained for out of that one. Because Yasuo used Summoner spells. Oh. So let's get in this shit. We are 4-1-1 one, and one so far. This is going so much better now that I have one game under my belt worth of practice. So good job, us. Now let's see, is this thing up? Because if it's up, I want it. Oh. 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 Wait, beat! Holy shit! 
And the kill coming in. All right, whirling death definitely causing some demise there. Uh oh, barred off on the wings, but it's not gonna matter. I'm just gonna go get my lich bane, and we'll get back into the mix. If I want to go for the full CDR, by the way, I may have to actually go for Ionian boots this game, because at this rate, the way this game is going, I may not have the time to um, cap out my CDR for you lovely young fellows if I do not go for this. So let's see, he is going to probably, probably get out. Yeah. So Yasu just gonna walk by, tornado him up, and he's just gonna skedaddle on past. Let's see, I can do this. If I get this, dude. If I get this, I'm a god. If I get this, I'm a fucking god. Go for it. Do it. Do it, Nocturne. Go on me. Okay, he's not going on me. No balls. <laughs> no fucking balls, dude. This Nocturne, honestly, I can I can hear his vagina whistling in the distance from here. And he's bottled. Like, that, that's saying something. So let's see, can we find this guy? There he is. Hey there, buddy. Hey. Hey there, friendo. How you doing? So I know I got bogeys off on the side, but maybe look at that, look at that! One more, come on! And whoop boom! Go ahead and do that right there. Maybe I can come on, speed up, and this slow, not gonna be enough, but the double kill coming in! And come on, come on, come on, rip! Alright, there goes that, go ahead and get, oh shit, okay, go ahead and just do this damage to him there, Q and auto attack, there goes the, or the Yasuo, I'm gonna be killing all of them, <laughs> alright, never mind, <laughs> rushing Lich Bane is the best idea I've ever had in my life, what the fuck, it's... this is busted, man, AP Sonomid is broken, alright, well, that's that's all the motivation I need. 70 CS, but we are 7, 1, and 1 now. We are big, so let's do it this way. Let's do it this way, because I want to experience 45% CDR. I'm going to get my Ionian Boots, my Fiendish Codex, and then after I get blue, I'll have 45% CDR. So now my Q on a 4.16 second cooldown, heal on 5 seconds, E on 6 seconds, my ultimate only minute and a half. That's very low for an ultimate that has that much impact on a game. It looks like Graves is gonna get fucked in the ass, as, you know, in my, all my fantasies, but... No matter how you look at it, it's not a good time for the little gravy baby right there. So, poor guy, but we are gonna grab this blue. This time we won't make him tank it for uh, a year before we pick it up. So, <laughs> once again, thank you for that, but I will not be having you do that again, because that is... That is, well unfair of me it's it's not cool on my part man it's not cool kaboom look at all that damage kill the blue and now on to the yasuo on to the yasu show all right wow there it is <laughs> there's his slow look at this damage he is out of there so that wind wall can't save you from my prowess my gigantic sona titties coming flying past that wall We'll be making it a little harder for you to uh, live as I diminuendo. Is that is that the one? This no, it's tempo. Never mind. Diminuendo is the it's the fucking it's obviously the W. All right, let's see where is he? Where is he at? Oh, there he is. What's good, baby? What's good? Come <laughs> Holy shit, dude! That damage is wicked. All right, give me that. Alright, let's go get this guy, speed him up, do some good damage here, and that's going to be, wow, go ahead and nail them both, that's going to be the double kill, just like that, holy shit, dude, 10, 1, and 2 now, what, what is going on, why is this so strong, why is this actually, oh my god, and it goes up to 30%, so I'm assuming the next level goes up to 40 Meaning my ability is going to be even lower cooldown. So 45% plus 30% is already pretty stinking low. Alright, let's go ahead and get that out of attack right there. Good lord. And Mordecai's just walking in. And he's going to beat him up. There's the kill. My man Mord. My boy. I'll go ahead and give Miss Fuckboy right there a little heal, a little kiss on the butt. A little, you know, smoochies. 
Mama's kisses. Did anybody remember that? <laughs> Holy shit, dude. That damage is just ridiculous. And this tower gonna go down. Zack the Grim Guzzler coming in! And we are going to be, well, losing the Yasuo clone. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Okay. Woo! Go ahead and stun him up mid-flight. Will not be getting me. But will they get me here? Nah, son. Nah, son. All right, maybe. Uh, yeah, that's going to be the double kill. Oh, God. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm alive. Wait. I'm fucking alive. No way. Oh, my God. I'm alive, dude. I can't believe I'm alive right now. What? We just... We just ran it down mid in the most literal term, or in the most literal sense. Good God. Oh, wait, wait. Okay, I got the assist because I hit my W button. Is this... Is this actually going to be a pre-20 minute victory? No way, right? Okay, so I'm saved from damage for a second. Looks like he is taking some pain. That's going to be the legendary for me. Well, another stack of legendary. <laughs> We're actually gonna get this tower already. So there's that tower going down, but I don't have mana to finish this shit off. So unfortunately, I gotta get out of here. I gotta diggity dip out like, uh, you know, I gotta make like a tree and split. I gotta make like a, a banana and bark at the moon. So, oh, flashing over the wall there. Not gonna bother for a dash, but, you know, as he goes, he's gonna realize that he did just flash over the wall right at the precise location of the enemy's base gate, which is questionable. But it's okay. I'm going to go for a Rylize? No, needlessly large rod. Well, I mean, they both build it out of needlessly large rod, but I'm going to go for this thing. The Rabadon's Fedora. Tip, tip, ladies. But 12, 1, and 7 now. Go ahead and speed ourselves up. With this E... I get 37% more movement speed until I'm damaged. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. It... Like, at max level, I already have it on a 4.5 second cooldown. It lasts for 3 seconds for everyone around me. That's basically a permanent, like, Shirelia's aura. That's ridiculous. Alright, Nocturne, I'm sorry, buddy. But you ain't getting out of this one, my friend. You ain't getting out of this one. Kaboom! That's gonna be one kill right there. And let's see it. Maybe we can go for more. Slowing him down with the Q. There's the double kill. See you later, Mr. Man. And let's go ahead and keep on... You know, there is no brakes on this destruction train. I'm flashing in. Come here. Come on. Rawr. Rawr. Come on. I'm not done with you guys. I'm not done with you. Come on. Rawr. That's one kill. And... I'm, I'm actually living. I'm, this is working. Why is why is this working? What the fuck? This is this is insane. Holy shit! Good God! He's dead. He's so dead. Okay, and Zach coming in, but he's gonna regret this decision immediately. The double kill coming in right there. Beat's gonna go down, but he will get the bard. And a 15, 1, and 10 game. Under 20 minutes. They couldn't even surrender if they wanted to. That is what we call forced anal pounding in the realm of League of Legends. S plus on the Sona, S on Draven, S plus on the Mordekaiser. What's this damage at? Draven did more than me. That is amazing that B actually managed to do more damage than me. I thought I was popping off, but B... Young Beast living up to his name. Holy shit. Actually out. <laughs> Round of applause right there. Round of applause. But an astonishingly strong showing from the AP Sona still. Nonetheless, 15, 1, and 10 showing the absolute power it displays in mid lane right now uh, with all the changes for her. Now, that was definitely a special case, right? Obviously, not every game is going to go like this. But it has definitely got some real strength. And if you guys did enjoy this video, you do want to try it out, I do recommend it. If you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or Twitch. Although, all things... All things... All links will be in the description below. www.website.com forward slash ankle spanking. You'll find me somehow. Um, and as always, I love you guys. And I hope you do have a wonderful day. Peace!